start of the game, I, I didn't think that he or Damian were particularly on top of their game. You know, we start the game with a rim shot, and he misses the dunk. And then defensively, I mean, we knew they were going to be a hard night for him because of the way they were going to use him in the ball screens. And uh, we knew they were going to have to drive the ball. And uh, But I thought in the first half when we got out, we're up, went, what, three and a half, four minutes without scoring, and that's what really turned the game around, that uh, our offense – wasn't very good, and then they we broke down a couple times on defense. They made some threes, but uh, uh, the second half we did a better job rebounding, better job doing some things. And uh, but you know Jordan came in, had a great night shooting the ball to start with. And but that, again, I thought our offense uh, we, we just lost some momentum when we just got a little anxious and started trying to play one on one and allowed them in the first half to get back. Coach, they scored the first three points of the second half, and then you guys go on a 17-0 run. What what happened during that stretch? Well, again, you know, we uh, they were doing a uh, what, what the biggest thing we did in the second half. We worked so hard at trying to pressure the ball, get into the ball, and they they do a nice job of screening. We weren't standing in front of the ball, and we obviously when you pressure the ball, you want to have good backside help, and they're excellent at driving in and kicking out. So in the second half, what we talked about was we're going to definitely stay in front of the ball and not get sucked in and be out there and, uh, and just stay in front of the ball. And, and they drive it. We wanted them to actually go and try to make a play off the dribble as opposed to being able to kick out and then try to come over and block some shots, and we were able to do that in the second half. But uh, our defense was uh, in the second half, uh, scored 22 points, a uh, big difference in the game. They shot in the second half, what, 22%? I mean, uh, they shoot that. 18% in the second half, and that allowed us to get out some because of some of the plays we made defensively to get in the open court and get some baskets against their defense that was really packed back in there, obviously, and uh, they wanted us to settle for the three, and uh, we knocked some down early, but we got a little bit too happy with it. What did you tell Dexter, because, you know, they weren't helping out on him, and in the second half, he just... Well, again, he kept the ball up and he turned, and uh, you know, and again, the guys, it's, it's it's very difficult to get the ball in there when when uh, he's uh, in a, a really a, a sagging kind of defense, and so when he gets it, he's going to have to uh, operate in traffic. And, but he kept the ball up, and um, and that's what we need from him. So sooner or later, we have to decide if they're going to, and we start making some threes, mix it together. But again, it, they stayed back in there. Dexter Pippen on your left, Damian James on your right. Damian became the third player in school history to uh, reach the thousand career rebounds last night. Questions? Dex, what, what did what did you do differently in the second half? They were still burning. I might have to come out there with the mentality um, to help my team. It was all about my team, and Coach told me and Damian that we had, we didn't show the first half, so. I took it upon the challenge upon myself to go out there and make a difference. And I know when, whenever Damien up off the court, <clears throat> I got to be the one in the inside rebounding and going out there every ball. And so I just had to have the mentality. All right, Damien, you, uh, Scott said you passed 1,000 rebounds. Is it just a number to you, or is it a source of pride? Or anything? Oh, not really. I just, you know, I really just care about this team. And, um, like Dick said, Coach said we didn't show up the first half, so I really had to take it upon myself to try to do do the things that were necessary um, to try to get the big guy the ball, open up the, the, um, the, the, game, the game for everybody else. So I really don't worry about my individual stats. I just I just care about winning. Damien, this is a there's a lot of great young talent on this team, but do the do the veterans feel responsible for this team? Um, yeah, that, that's our job because those those guys really don't. Don't know the ropes yet. They still learning, um, but they 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 got great talent, and, and as you can see tonight, they really, they can really help us when other guys are struggling um, off the bench. That's what makes us a pretty good team. Our bench can come in and, and pick it up. Um, we just have to um, come out tomorrow and really play harder. Um, we have to take it upon ourselves to bring it the first and the second half um, to try to get this victory. Any other questions?